Hi guys. So I'm getting ready to leave the house. Well, the hotel room. And this is my look today. Um, fun fact. Goodbye. I feel like joining them, but they might all stop and look at me instead. I got out the cab looking for the coconut corridor dream something scenic area and this is what i got and i wasn't impressed i was like oh it's just a long stretch of trees there's a main road that's very noisy and locals just going about their business doing activities that they would do on a normal day here in china this would definitely fascinate somebody who is new to china but not somebody who lives in china Watching and listening to those men play the saxophone was quite pleasant but I got back into a cab and headed towards Tianya Haijiao and as you can see on that map on the GPS it's a long stretch of road along Sanya Bay so this is this Tianya place I don't know, I'm not so optimistic about it because we had to drive so long to get here. You get dropped off on the side of the road over there and then you walk through. There's already a very long queue. I don't know where to even buy a ticket, but yeah, we'll see. So you get dropped off on the side of the road, you come in over there and then you walk across to this ticket center here where there's that oval type circle thing close to this entrance here so this is the entrance when you have your ticket but you buy it here so don't get confused by going to the right side because they're not going to help you they're just going to look at you like why are you lost yeah knowing a bit of chinese helped but here it is go in and you buy a ticket to just go and see a beach with rocks this is crazy this is crazy So the lovely lady's showing us like what are the prices for some of these activities that you can do here. Uh, turn it around. Um, <laughs> so this is where we are. The center is here. So she says that from here for you to walk to these rocks, it's 2.5 kilometers and then to walk back another 2.5 kilometers so when you pay for a ticket of 81 there you're gonna only just get entrance and then tour this place on your own but these are the extra activities that she's showing us that you can do so i think it's a place to come here when you're like wearing a bathing suit and all of that ready to get wet helicopter ride 580 yes, five minutes, five minutes? Five minutes, Aya. Aya, this is Aya. Aya is really, really good in English and she can show you all the offerings that they have. She can show you exactly what packages they have and she can explain it in English and help you buy a ticket as well. She's just fantastic. <laughs> and then you go through here. You scan your ticket essentially and then walk out and then start your journey to to the beach turn right and make your way so if you if i paid 15 renminbi extra i would get the sightseeing bus 
and yeah that's where you you turn left for the sightseeing bus turn right and walk if you didn't pay for the sightseeing bus which i didn't pay for maybe i should have but nah it's okay hmm? closing off beaches to make more money out of tourists not such a bad idea i guess let's go see what's there to see so you're not allowed to walk in the middle the guard just signaled to me that i should walk on the side <laughs> Right, hope this is gonna be really worth it. Okay, so walk, walk here, walk here, Dora. Walk hey, here. I got this a lot while on this trip. Mm, this is the way if you didn't pay for a sightseeing vehicle. <laughs> I think it's a lovely place to come and just chill the whole day by the beach. But the fact that you damn well pay, I think I can't get over that. Okay. So can you hear that helicopter? Can you see that helicopter? That's the one for 580 RMB for five minutes. That is ludicrous, purely ludicrous. But anyway, if you want to try it, go for it. But yeah, we're still going along. This place is very huge. It's very, very huge. I'm not even halfway. I haven't covered even 10% of it. So in case in the, at the ticket office, you decided not to buy the ticket, you can buy it here these buggy station places for 15 renminbi you can buy and then you can get that vehicle to a bus if you're tired of walking which i think i might actually do because i'm not wearing the right shoes for this <laughs> anyway my photographer today very kind man very patient and i'm sitting under a beautiful tree <laughs> he was sitting here and he was so willing to help me my selfie stick was not winning but here's this beautiful view restaurants as well if you want to have some chinese food and have a drink lots of beautiful places to sit lots of restaurants Keep walking, chill at the beach. Just come here and spend the day. That over there looks like the place where if you bought that ticket to do any water activity, you go over there. traveling is having others take pictures of you these two helped me take pictures and I helped them take pictures too those two up there just bought me a drink <laughs> so sweet they got me this just because I took a picture with them oh how sweet take your shoes off get your feet wet get in the water and take gorgeous pictures Every turn just seemed to be the perfect time to take a picture. I didn't get to tour the whole area, but guys, if you do get to go to this place, wear the right shoes first and tour this place. It is gorgeous. There you go. <laughs> Hello. And you are wonderful. Da, da, da. Do 
you take this man as your lawfully wedded husband? Oh, no, I don't. <laughs> Goodness. <laughs> you, you walk away. You walk. I walk away. Say hi in my video. Hi, I'm French. <laughs> <laughs> Is that your name? <laughs> Apparently, I guess. I'm French. Hi, nice to meet you. I'm French. <laughs> I've never been to Bali, but I felt like I was in Bali. Hit me with your beauty! <laughs> huh? Wow, Bali on set is extremely <laughs> <laughs> this is something I didn't pay much attention to, but have a look at the signs while you're there. They will help guide you to these scenic spots within the scenic area that's so huge and give you a fuller experience. Ah, the peace and privacy and bathtub that I paid for that I can enjoy at the end of the day. It was a lot of walking. My feet hurt. I was wearing the wrong shoes. So I deserved that soak in the tub while I was waiting for my dinner. <laughs> Coming up next, we'll be going to the Yalong Bay Tropical Paradise Forest Park. This place was so lovely. You don't want to miss it. Like, subscribe and stay tuned.